I turn to the necromancer, some witticism ready on my tongue. The taunt died where it sat, her whole face right now. The flesh lay sunken on her limbs, pulsing sporadically. The body that seduced my eyes now held all the allure of a famine corpse. She held me with a dark gaze, glittering in rotten slaughter. She laughed, and her laugh came as the sound of wet rags flapping in the wind. The brother stood with me now. Gorgo made no move keeping his place. The little Lucrotas crouched together in the shadows. We are many, and you are one, my lady, and a damned ugly one at that. So you best step aside and let us pass, I said. Somehow, I didn't think she was going to, but nothing ventured, nothing gained, as they say. That worn flesh of hers crawled into a smile so wide I could see her jawbones past the hinge point. For a second, her face rippled and we saw Gaines there, screaming as he fell. The dead are many, child. I'll let you pass into their well. The temperature fell and kept falling, like there wasn't any bottom for it to hit. It went from uncomfortable to painful to plain stupid in no time at all, and the noise. The awful grinding as the skeletons built themselves from pieces and wrapped themselves in the spirit mist around us. Do it! Just do it! Yes, you can! Just do it! If you're tired of starting over, stop giving up. <laughs>